we got here quarantine baby Oi. the same bed I like this wait it's just like a serious beep but you can't actually get into the shower from the other side that is so strange okay this side nope okay oh my god how do i open this curtain Okay, there's no balcony at these Novotels. I mean, it's not bad though. <laughs> Let's make this homely. There. <laughs> so our flight from Tokyo to Auckland was successful. We landed in Auckland. And we're staying Auckland. And the government has set us up in the Novotel, the Auckland Airport Novotel. It's pretty nice. Yeah. Um. Oh my god, my brain. Yeah, just been flying. Just been flying. Uh, so we got here, and they had like you know the rule like two meters apart. Everyone must stand <clears throat> two meters apart. Um. And a lot of just paper filling. It was actually really easy to come to the customs. I accidentally took the CBD gummies and got them through Japan's customs, I guess, because it's legal there. Um, but I ditched them in the airplane because I didn't want to risk it in Auckland because CBD is not legal in New Zealand. Um, but yeah, here at Novotel for two weeks um yeah there's meant to be a medical uh, a nurse is meant to come around and uh test us all well not test us but screen us and ask us a couple questions and stuff but I think she like ran out of paperwork and so she said she'll just come to our room I mean we can't leave for 24 hours anyway so it's not like we're going anywhere um Vanessa's up on the 11th floor on the top floor and then there's Reza, me and Pon all in a row on the 10th floor um which I think those two floors are the premier floor so we're pretty lucky um Yeah, about to do 14 day lockdown here in Auckland, which should be interesting. But I did buy some gin at Duty Free. Look how pretty this is. So this is about to be me. Gonna have a. If I can open it. It's so hard because I'm scared to break all my other nails because it really hurt. Mmm. It smells really nice. Just a little one. It's lunchtime. On it. It is quarantine time actually, who cares? But um I feel like I might fall asleep. try some as is so I can actually taste it. Mm. 
Mm. That's really nice. I just lipped it, so if I've got corona, this whole bottle's fucked. <laughs> Cheers. Oh, look at the other things I bought. Bought these cute Studio Ghibli cards for quarantine. In case the homies want to play cards. So, like, real cute. <clears throat> and then, yeah. Um. Yeah, what else? I've decorated the room with my two teddy bears I have. Both of them are limited edition spring Japan. Yeah. So that's cute. Kind of match my hair. Day two in quarantine and bitch needs to do her brows. So I'm going to do that. Drink some gin and juice and have a dance. Ordered some juice. Oh, yeah. This is a really good gin. Pluck my brows. Oh my god, this pimple. So I'm in my hotel and I... Oh, where's my lip cut? I decided that was going to color my hair. I bought these from just like a pharmacy in japan they were really cheap they were like 250 yen each it was like just over a thousand yen for the lot but i realized <laughs> this is gonna be like the hoariest because i don't have a tin bowl a brush or gloves anything so i'm just gonna mix it in this hotel cup and then just wash it very thoroughly and mix it with my hands. I've got a comb. But yeah. Let's have some fun. So I'm using Devil's Trick. I think it's called like Quee Quee color or some shit. I, wa I tried to find tutorials of people using these colors and they're far and few. Um, they don't look awesome, but they last like one week, so fuck it, why not? Hopefully I can do this one before tonight, oh, because Reza wants to go for a run. Okay. Let's see. Use this pink. Got a plastic spoon. I can't buy anything from the supermarket because the deliveries are filled up. And we're not allowed to leave. So I'm staying in the Novotel in Auckland. Government funded quarantine. This stuff smells amazing. That's what I got so far. And it's really red, which I don't like. So I might make it. It makes a tiny bit of blue in. Just a little bit of blue. To give it a cooler tone because I don't really like. And you're probably meant to shampoo your hair first, but. I find with my hair, because it's so porous, it always just works better when I just do it as is. That's all good. Okay. My hair has 
has faded the most in the front, whereas the back and in between is actually quite pink. So I'm going to focus on this top section. The reason I like doing my roots only is because I don't really mind the like faded look on the roots. And if I have heaps of colour left, I know I can do the ends. But like I have today, <laughs> I've run out. So it's still a look. With the rest of my hair, I might just wash it, allow it to like soak into the ends and kind of colour them lightly which is possibility if it's strong enough, if it's not, then that won't happen, it's fine. Um, but if I don't really like the lack of uh, balayage of ombre, then I might put this maybe with some conditioner, because it's meant to be this dark. Oh yeah, so the pink is meant to be this colour. And blue is meant to be this colour, but obviously I mixed these two for both colours, which you can see are vividly different. Who knows, maybe I'll get really bored and I'll do like my end side of mint. <laughs> we'll see. Actually turned out like pretty good, like it is um, a more red pink than I had before, from what I can see. That's all good. And the purple kind of turned out. So, let that comb go. Oh. It's definitely way more vibrant than it was before I coloured it. Um, so I only conditioned my hair and just rinsed it for ages till it was clear, just because it helps the colour last. So, oh, did that chew? Sorry, the person who cut my fringe missed heaps of bits, so I am really looking forward to going home and having my hairdressing scissors and fixing it myself. I'm gonna dry it and style it and maybe just put some makeup on for shits and gigs and to kill some time till dinner. And then I'll show you the end result. So I have that second gin. I love this colour. I'm stoked with it. What a win. Look at that sky, it's so pretty, loves. 
just in time before that light disappears. Ah, I love it. Yay. Kind of matches my lipstick androgyny, so I'm feeling that. So the one lipstick I wear. Yeah. What a quarantine win. New hair. New hair. It's dark. We're going for a night walk. In quarantine. <laughs> After 24 hours, you're actually allowed to go for a night walk. You're allowed to exercise, just not allowed to go to the supermarket. That's why you're in self quarantine. Just night walks? Or just walks? night walks. <laughs> all, all day walks. <laughs> but, oh, and day walks. So, this is our <laughs> second walk of the day, which is pretty nice. It's good to get out and sniff some trees and shit. <laughs> just gonna roll myself, a uh, roll. <laughs> I'm gonna pour myself. Another gin and juice. Ooh, creepy. It's strong. Just the way I like it. Um, oh my god, where's the lid to the oh, yeah. So, I'm gonna go outside again. We just did like, how many have we done today? We've done like, like, 12,000 steps, so that ain't bad. Can't complain. Sorry, I took the key out and now I have no light. So that's fun. But I'm enjoying these, these walks. They're good. Back downstairs. Lost my key for a moment, but we got it. It's 2.30. Stop me now. There's my shit though. I'm going to draw a bit. You may do stationery. Got a studio of Ghibli book. It's like. Pencils. Shut up there. Hope you can some paper from the hotel. And a gin somewhere. of quarantine and I'm so hungover today I'm just gonna watch TV and try to exercise it off maybe if I sweat I will feel less like a bag of dicks I still have <clears throat> yesterday's leftover makeup on me because I'm a gross bitch so I am gonna do a face scrub and mask and everything because I am just dead inside. What is this? Gross. The same porridge though. We're on day six, folks. 
And I totally forgot to like show you guys what our meals are. So this is like a, I don't know, some kind of rice. I've had it before. I just like the same four meals over and over. Some steamed broccoli. Um, a beetroot salad, which I love beetroot and rocket, so I'm not even, I ain't even mad. This one piece of feta though. <laughs> Um, and this pavlova. This is the first time I've gotten like a this kind of dessert. And this looks like a chocolate cake, which I don't eat. Chocolate flavor. Or cakes, obviously, because it's my hoard of cakes and blisters and things that I just don't eat. The food is pretty healthy. good it's like a diet <laughs> so it's like day nine or ten of self-isolation here um, at the Novotel Novotel It's not bad. I just had a really yum yummy lunch. It's like a pasta with like herbs and capsicum and onion and zucchini, which is my favorite. So can't complain. The food is free. Accommodation is free. I'm pretty bored and I don't know what to do. Um, I don't really have much on me. I don't have much. I brought toys. And I've got my tarot cards. So maybe I'll do a tarot on myself. Stop. <clears throat> my hair colour. Is lasting all right I don't hate it I don't really like this red undertone in here I've been really thinking of completely changing my hair this morning I was thinking like maybe bright red or orange or blue because blue suits me or leaving like my fringe in this front section like that and then doing the rest black Ooh, that's a change but we'll see I can't do it now anyway I have to wait till like weeks away and I can go to the supermarket I think it's like day 8 for living so we've got a lot for lunch today it's like frittata, which is kind of gross. <laughs> Some steamed potatoes, which I will not eat because I'm not a fan of plain potatoes. Fussy bitch. And a salad, which I actually, I love salad. And this carrot cake, which I will not eat. But they still give it to you, even when you write crosses on those items they'll still give you it that's why I've got so much coca-cola fruit water these things so this is kind of cute they gave us like a little biscuit a chocolate thing and a hot cross bun for Easter with a little note <laughs> Stop! Oh my god! <laughs> Queen! <laughs> have finished our two weeks! Yay! We're heading to the domestic airport so we can go back to Wellington. Mm. <laughs> I'm like waiting for you to fall. <laughs> Freedom!